This year's Barclays ATP World Tour Finals was as popular as ever, attracting a total attendance of 252,481. The 2016 edition welcomed the tournament's two millionth fan since moving to London in 2009, and we picked them out of the crowd. We have our winner. Congratulations. Sasha from Hull, the lucky winner who got invited backstage to pick up an extra special prize. Sasha, many congratulations. How did that happen just now? I don't know, I was just waving frantically at the cameras and didn't think it would be us. Well, yeah, just amazed. <laughs> You've won two tickets to the final on Sunday. Wow, brilliant. Here they are. Thank you very much. And afterwards, you'll meet the winner. Uh, wow, wow, yeah, speechless. Andy, let me introduce you to Sasha. You've both made a bit of history here this week. Okay. You've won the tournament, world number one, but she, two millionth fan. She won tickets to come here and meet you and ask you a few questions. I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> and first, I love the fact that you've got your shoelaces. You know what? I do that all of the time and I get told off by my mum and my wife all the time about it and I just, it's a bad habit I'm in. How important is it to have an overall competitive streak, or do you think it's more important that, to have like kind of like one player that just pushes you that that bit further, that rivalry that just pushes you that bit extra? I, I've always been pretty competitive because I always had my brother was always like yeah. he's 15 months older than me, so everything we did, he was always a bit better than me. So I was always trying to get better than him. You know, a lot of people have talked about the era that I've played in and how tough it's been with the, the players around, um, with Novak and Roger and Rafa. But it's also helped me become better because I've always been trying to catch up to the best players of all time. Congratulations on becoming a father. Thanks. And I'd just like to ask, how diff difficult is it um, being a family man and how much of an impact does that have on you as a tennis player? It's great that I won today but I get to go home tonight and be with my daughter in the morning and had I lost, that's what I would have got to do as well and that's the most important thing in me and my, my wife's life now. So, you know, still, you still have to put the work in, yeah. but it's just, it definitely helped me sort of be a bit more sort of level-headed throughout the year and not have to, the ups and downs maybe that I used to have. Oh, good questions, <laughs> really. Questions. Very good, Andy, well done. Thanks Thank for your you. time. Thank you very Thanks. much indeed. See you, Thank you. Thank you. See you later. Thank you. Thank you. Lovely, quick photo.